do you have your spark plugs gapped properly? Do you even know what a spark plug does in a motor? I thought it'd be important to start covering some of the basics of car maintenance for those individuals who may not have been exposed to it and don't know what it is when the shop says, we need to replace all your spark plugs. Or somebody says, did you gap your spark plugs properly? So I have in front of me a box that's just an older Champion spark plug. So let's talk about it for just a second. First of all, what is a spark plug in a motor? Well, the spark plug is a very important part of your engine. This screws into the top of your motor. It has provided an electrical pulse. And if you look at this, that gap that's in between this electrode and the bottom part of this spark plug, there'll be a small spark that happens. That's the reason why it's called a spark plug. And it ignites the fuel and that's what makes your engine run. That's the simple version of it. But when you buy these, as you can see, there's a gap in between those two components. Now, most spark plug manufacturers pre-gap these, and so you don't need to do anything. But I do recommend that you get yourself a spark plug gap tool. Now, this one is so old, it was actually a copper version. You can see where it started to turn green like an old penny. But your manufacturer of your car vehicle will say exactly what the spark plug gap needs to be. And all you do is take this tool, and you can see it's got a tapered edge, and you slide it into this gap. And that is how you can create more or less gap. I always check every spark plug that I replace, even if the factory says that they have gapped it. Here's another thing. If you were to accidentally drop a spark plug right here, Check it for damage. Check to make sure that this gap hasn't changed. This gap can lead to engine knock, ignition problems, poor fuel mileage. I mean, there's a ton of different things that can happen. It's also important that you purchase a quality spark plug. This isn't a little bit cheaper model champion. You're gonna see models like NGK as an example. You're gonna see um, Bosch. You're gonna see maybe a Denso. You're gonna see Champion. Most manufacturers have an OE plug that they liked. Try to get the OE plug, the original equipment. There's also a difference in spark plug temperature. We may cover that in another video. So unless you've had a turbo or supercharger, stick with the OE temperature rating as well. That's your quick intro to spark plugs. Keep wrenching, have a good time. One Goofy Garage.